I reflect what I enjoyed, it's not the winning. And I was, again, fortunate, won World Cups and lots of trophies. But the thing I loved was, was playing in teams, you know, and, and sharing those experiences with, with mates. And that's, you know, the, the greatest part about being a rugby player or being a sportsman. And so if you, if you think of that, then when you think of coaching or parenting your children, you know, that's the things you want to encourage. Just go out there and enjoy it. Got involved in a number of different sports growing up. For me, it was about giving everything a go, and sport was really enjoyable in that aspect to meet different people and then also get to experience lots of different sports. So I got involved in gymnastics, netball, hockey, basketball, volleyball, and throughout my experiences in all of those different sports, I got to experience what I truly liked, and then that's what allowed me to find my passion in athletics and know that that was the sport for me. It's important to talk to your child and understand why they do sport. For a lot of kids it's about doing sport to be with their friends. For others it's about receiving support from the sideline. So understanding those different aspects, for most it's actually not about winning, it's about the enjoyment of the sport. It's important to monitor the load and training intensities that your kids are doing. My parents have always said to me from that young age that if I didn't enjoy it then don't do the sport and I think that was a really nice thing for me because I never felt the pressure to stay in the sport and yeah as kids things can feel quite serious quite early at a young age when they shouldn't but again it should be about having fun. You're always taught the value of like, process rather than outcome and that was whether you're an all black or a teenager if you focus on outcomes, you learn bad habits, you take shortcuts, and it's just not conductive to you being a better athlete. Whereas if you focus on the process, developing good behaviours, good habits, and where that will lead you, that will lead you. You need to encourage mistakes. Mistakes are what help us develop and get better, and, and your attitude around that has to be positive. You know, you have to see it that way, so that kids feel the same way, so they don't drop their head, they don't, you know, give up on the sport because they've made a mistake. They think, okay, you know, I've made a mistake, but how, how can I can get better? And let them figure that out for themselves. I felt the most confident in sport when there's been positive talk from the sideline, and that's ultimately enabled me to bring my best to the game. Focusing on good sportsmanship as a, as a parent from the sideline is really important. Children mirror, you know, their parents' behaviour and, and if they see you as a parent being totally engrossed with the result or, or even big outcomes in a game like, like tries, like for sure, enjoy them, celebrate them, that, that's part of, you know, a, for me, a healthy relationship with sport. You know, you, you want to see your kids smiling, so you've got to be smiling 